because the image to speak, the image of man, in the name of man, by the power of man, to the glory of man. The accumulated minds of men in a machine that becomes God. Believe it or not, there's churches today that have AI, preach the word of God to them. Read it as a minister in the pulpit. It's a big screen. And AI speaks. I mean, they couldn't have known, John didn't know, the mystery of godliness to any great depth in your early beginnings when we first believed. Seeing things in the future that we in the present at that time, 2,000 years ago, couldn't understand. Yet we in the end time can understand it. What it meant that he calls this image to speak. The glorified image of man, the name of man by the power of man to the glory of man, accumulated minds in a machine, he calls it to live. With humanity today, some seeking to destroy this image, this AI, and warning us. We were warned, not only by scripture, but by those with the mind of Christ today, whether they're aware of this or not, speaking the truth and those going headlong, heading straight to hell. Jesus didn't come in his own name. He came in the name of the Father, God the Father. One is to call no man Father, even this machine. Yet he said there would come a day, and that day is past approaching, where this image will speak a new image of God and come in its own name, in the name of man, in the power of man, to the glory of man, doctrines of men, influenced by doctrines of devils and demons, giving up on the collective minds of men and turning to AI, artificial intelligence, pretending to be God, all knowing omnipresent, the mystery of iniquity being revealed.